Thieves are stealing the Christmas spirit. When you put up the red flag on your mailbox, you're expecting your card or gift to get to its destination. That's not the case for several Wabash Valley neighborhoods. News 10's Abby Kirk has the story. I had no idea. Rebecca, who chooses to keep her last name anonymous, had no idea. It's a shame. That a local woman decided to have some fun. Very quiet. At the quiet expense. It's a great neighborhood. Of her neighborhood. People are out of money and they're looking for money. It just shows you the lengths that they will go to. Sergeant Joe Watts says a Terre Haute woman, Carol Gossman, was pulled over for a standard traffic violation last Wednesday. There were envelopes uh, opened, uh, cards laying out. That's when the officer reported finding numerous drugs. Cash credit cards, as well as three bags full of open and stolen mail in the back seat of her car. The mail, come to find out, was from uh, residents around the Harrison Woods area. Police say after connecting the pieces, the mail all came from the same place. It's a, it's a crime and drugs are associated with it. For 17 years, Rebecca has been living in Harrison Woods in Terre Haute. Yeah, I've really cut back on doing that. Now she's being more cautious. Just for security reasons. Of sending checks, money, and gift cards through the mail. Mail it to where the person works, if you will. Maybe mail it to where it's registered, where someone has to sign for that card. Police are working with the U.S. Postal Inspector's Office. They're sorting through all the mail. Watts says there is no way they will be able to determine how much money is missing from it all.